guys, my name's Natalie. Welcome to my channel. Today I will be reacting to Superfruits cover of Katy Perry's Rise featuring a whole range of guests. I wouldn't say like I'm a huge Katy Perry fan or anything, but I do listen to her music if it comes on on the radio. I'm not going to go out of my way to change the station or anything. Um, I don't know if I've heard this song to be completely honest. But yeah, I am excited to see what they do with it, specifically because I know what Scott and Mitch can do with their voices. Obviously, having reacted to and listened to them uh, in Pentatonics, I don't believe I know any of the other guests that they are featuring in the song. Uh, so I'm eager to see how that all works out. So let's do it. I won't just survive. Is it a slow song? Oh wait, Mary Lambert, I think I know who that is. I won't just conform no matter We all know I'm biased at this point. Cause my roots they run deep. The voice is just so beautiful. Oh, this is cool. They've been longtime friends, hey. Oh wow, this is the first time I've heard just those two sing together. They're really good. I don't know who that is, but he's good. Whoa, I like whatever that was right there. I don't think his voice is as strong. Through the madness and chaos, oh, that's pretty. So I, call on my angel. I like her voice. They say, oh, give so little faith. Don't doubt it, don't doubt it. Victory is in my veins. You know it, you know it. That's a nice touch. I like when they have a female influence because it just has a whole different sound. Oh, that was good, that was good. This is awesome. I like that. Wow. Do they know that this is going to work this well? Because it works this well. Wow. Their, vo their voices all mesh so well together. Wow, good ending. Okay, so I've heard of Mary Lambert before, but I hadn't, I don't know about the other two. Not the first guy, because he was really strong, and then he did this like little thing where he transitioned, and I, whew, that was really good. Um, the second guy wasn't as strong vocally, but um, there were some notes that he hit that just like shifted really well. The only thing that was weird for me is because I'm so used to reacting to Scott and Mitch in pentatonics and not really having too many instruments involved to like really strongly hear a piano in the background was a bit different. I haven't heard the Katy Perry version so I really don't know uh, how it's supposed to sound. And then the inclusion of a female voice, I think despite the fact that Mitch's range is very high, I think a female voice, and I don't know if it's just because they, like, women project their voices differently. It brings a whole different sound uh, when a woman's involved. Uh, like when Kirsten...
and sings in pentatonics you can definitely hear her voice present when it is there um and so i really like that and i like that they closed with mary as well i think i will definitely be covering more super fruit in the future uh, so if you would like to have your say as to what I cover from them or you would like to have input in any other videos that I cover, sit down or otherwise, feel free to leave your suggestions in the comments down below. Otherwise, you can at me at Twitter. That and all of my other social media are linked in the down bar below. Thank you for liking, commenting and subscribing. Have a wonderful day and I will see you guys next time with a new video.